Hello, good morning my dear little ones. How are you today? This is your Parita ma'am. Remember? Okay, now tell me which colors you have learnt in your previous sessions. Do you remember them? Let me remind you. You have learnt about red color, blue color, yellow color, and green color right okay so today also i'm going to teach you about colors first tell me what is the color of your hair black right and what is the color of your teeth white color correct so today we are going to learn about black and white color. Ready to learn? Okay. You know children, there are many things around you which are in black and white colors. Have you observed it? There are so many animals, birds, so many things, so many insects are in black color or in white color. Have you ever seen when your mama is cooking in the kitchen? You have seen? Salt is white in color, sugar is white in color, then there are some pulses which are black in color, right? Okay, now let's learn about some things through flashcards which are in black and white color. Let's see some black color objects. Blackboard, black bat. Black camera, black cat, black guitar, black sunglasses, and black umbrella. Now, let's see some white color objects. White feather, white clouds, white ice cream, white swan, white egg, white shoes. And white rabbit okay children so you have seen some things which are in black color or in white color right but there are many things or many animals which are of both the colors means black and white both the colors like the animal zebra zebra is white with black stripes on his body so it is in black and white both the colors let's see some of them Black and white cow, black and white zebra, black and white football, black and white penguin, black and white chessboard, and black and white cat. Okay, let's see the zebra crossing. This is the picture of zebra crossing. Whenever we have to cross the road while walking, we are supposed to walk on zebra crossing. Zebra crossing is of black and white stripes. So let's do one activity and make one zebra crossing and traffic signal. For that we need white paper some black strips and glue so let's start taking black strips one by one and apply the glue on it and stick it on the white paper like this 
then another black strip apply the glue again and at a distance stick it like this now another strip and at a distance like this and the last one you can take the help of a mamma to cut the paper you are not supposed to use scissors okay children so like this See, what is this? Isn't it looking like a zebra crossing? Now, let's make a traffic signal. For that, we need one black strip like this and one piece of black paper like this. And we'll stick them together. Have you seen children? Which color lights are there on the traffic signal? Red yellow and green let's stick them on the traffic signal the first is red color then yellow color and the last is green color so can you see this children Red says stop, yellow says wait and green says go. So when the green light is on, you can cross the road while walking on the zebra crossing. Children, why this is called zebra crossing? Because it has black and white stripes. Same as zebra I hope you enjoyed this activity. Okay kids, bye-bye for today. I hope you enjoyed learning about colors. Right? Take care of yourself and keep practicing. Bye-bye.